Ra 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 ra. Vlogmas. Today I am in full mommy mode. I got my hair up in a ponytail, but I have my hair up in a ponytail a lot. <laughs> got my mascara on, my eyeshadow on, nothing else. My black tank top right here, and Devin's green pajama pants. Listen, I love y'all, but we've had a long weekend and I'm just not getting pretty today. The agenda for today is putting up that Christmas tree. Yes, I've been waiting for this for a while. You wanna come over here with mommy? Mm. While I update mm. everybody on what we're doing today? Mommy. Say hi guys! Hi guys! <laughs> See? <laughs> hi guys! <laughs> also, I need to finish unpacking today. Okay, so let me like just tell y'all what happened. So we left Wednesday and we spent all Wednesday with Devin's dad and then we spent Thanksgiving with both of our families and then Friday morning we were with Devin's dad. We didn't get back home until like 10 30 something like that Friday night and then Saturday was just a whirlwind of running errands, paying bills, getting grocery shopping done because Devin goes back to work well today, today's Sunday. Devin had to go back to work on Sunday so <laughs> it was like a big chaotic whirlwind when we first came home so now I am like officially unpacking because I have the time to do so and the last thing is I kind of need to give you guys a pet update so over the holiday we kind of did a thing and I got a new kitty this is Smokey hi baby he's not happy with me because I'm box training him I've figured out how to box train kittens what you do or at least what I do is you get a cage and you put the litter in there and you put the food in there and you only have to do it for a week because I only had to do it with Orca our other kitten I only had to do this for one week with Orca and he was trained in seven days so I have to do the same thing with Smokey you put it all in the cage you keep them in the cage for one week with the box they go in the box and they just learn that that's where they go so Smokey over here is being box trained, which is why he's not happy because I just took him out of the cage and he's like, let me go, human. So I need to put him like back in the cage because he's just going to like run away and he really does need to be box trained or he's going to poop all in my house. And animal we'll update number two is our puppy Ellie. Hi, Ellie. You love Ellie? Yeah. She's the one that named her. We got her at the same place we got Smokey, and we were like, hey, Carly, what do you want to name her? And we started listing names, like Sadie, that kind of thing, and Carly kept saying, no, no, no. So we said Ellie, and she goes, yeah. So this is Ellie. She's our German hound mix, and oh my gosh, you guys. Here, let me set the camera down so I can actually talk about her, because it's hard to like hold this thing and talk about her at the same time. So Ellie is like the best dog I have ever been around or met in my my life you know how like older dogs are like lazy and they just lay around and they're really sweet and loving and it's that personality in a puppy she's not hyper she doesn't jump she doesn't bite she doesn't do anything mean she's the complete opposite of Pongo Pongo was hyper from the get-go like when we got him put him in the car he was wanting to move around and he was wanting to get out and it was just completely different with Ellie we put her in the car she sat in the back with the girls and slept pretty much the entire ride up here. If the worst thing I have to worry about is house training her, I will deal with it because she's such a good dog. Are you wanting to eat, Ellie, huh? Are you wanting to eat? Are you hungry? She still doesn't understand like where her food is, so I bet I'll have to pick her up <laughs> and show her where her food is. I know, you're such a good girl. You're the best. Let's go outside, Ellie. Let's go outside, go pee pee. Come on. You did so good, Miss Ellie. You did so good. You went to go potty. I am actually amazed at the difference that just happened right there. I would take Pongo outside for like 20 minutes. He would not go outside. Then we would take him in and he would squat like right there 
like right, right there. And he would go potty like right there after I had just been out with him for like 20 minutes. Took Ellie outside 15 minutes after she had eat. Well, she didn't really eat much, but she drank. We were only out there for like five or 10 minutes and she went to go potty and I'm like, really? <laughs> wow, this is like, this is different. I need to unpack now because wow. Probably the worst part from coming home from a trip is all the laundry you now have to do. <sighs> Didn't I like just get all this done before we left? <laughs> I swear it never fails every time I go to the kitchen to do anything. <laughs> the girls feel the need to dance. Are you girls hungry? Yeah. You want some lunch? I try to need my lunch. Well, we have all this pizza still here from yesterday. And I'm really thinking about eating this for lunch because it's here and it needs eaten and why not and I'm probably gonna have some pecan pie because it's like pecan pecan however you say it I say pecan because it's my favorite pie ever and we only have it during the holidays and it's a little tiny pie like it's it's itty bitty so it's not like I'm gonna sit down and eat the whole pie well no I'm kidding I'm not <laughs> want to eat the whole pie but I'm not going to listen y'all I am not giving a flying crap about my diet right now because it's the holidays and I get to eat a little bit and enjoy myself and I'm just going to because I have a New Year's resolution for the first time and have I ever had an actual New Year's resolution? I don't know. I don't know if I have. But I have an actual one this year. But I'm not going to tell you about it until I actually do the New Year's resolution vlog later on in the month, but I am just not going to care right now because I'm going to have to care pretty soon. You look very sleepy. I think you're ready for a nap. I just want to very quickly like give you guys a very short preview of Wednesday's vlog because it's, it's going to be a good one and I'm really excited about it, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys like a little preview. I, I'm not in this. Like <laughs> She has another sister. I'm not in this. We're on the way home from Tennessee. Different sister. <laughs> yeah, okay. Because I have another one, apparently. <laughs> uh, for this question, you do! We were stuck in like five hour traffic, and this one had to pee really, really bad. Please stop right now. Please let that be the end of it. Please. <laughs> okay, I gotta get these children awake. I want to put up the Christmas tree and decorate it. I'm ready, you guys. <laughs> you are the only haw baby that is awake. You're the only one awake and smiley. Cans. Cans. Good morning, Cans. <gasps> Carly sleeps like this all the time. This is Carly's favorite way to sleep. Good morning, Princess. Is it time to feed the baby? It's time, yes. Belly's empty, tears are coming. Feed me. So, to feed Andy lately, I've been buying these cans of vegetables because she still only has her uh, bottom two teeth and that's it. So I've been buying these cans, which are like 60 some cents, and I'm going to like steam the carrots or the mixed vegetables or the green beans or whatever's inside and just feed that to her so you can still eat and I don't have to buy baby food. <sighs> Look what I have for you. Mm. <laughs> You're fed and happy. You're fed and happy. You're fed and happy. Let's do this.
so this is our finished tree with all of the ornaments like right down here at the bottom and hardly anything at the top because you know mom life so when the girls go to bed I'll most likely take the ornaments <laughs> down here at the bottom and put them at the top <laughs> otherwise this one is going to eat all of the ornaments and there's some glitter on some of these so you can't eat that princess yeah <laughs> So a couple of things before I go, because somebody is getting cranky and is only happy when I'm holding her. Uh, first is I normally don't like Christmas trees with snow on them. I never have liked them. I just think it looks kind of weird for a tree with snow on it to be in a warm house. It's just, I don't know, I've never liked them. But this tree was given to us by Devin's grandmother, and it's free, and it's pre-lit, and I'm like, well, we are gonna have to buy a new Christmas tree anyway. It's free, and it's already lit. Like, that was a big plus. I need a pre-lit tree at this point with three kids, as close in age as they are. Yeah, pre-lit trees are kind of necessary at this point. So I think I'm just gonna suffer it through this season, and when the Christmas trees go on sale after Christmas, Christmas. Probably gonna get a new one then. And the last thing is Miss Andy was not chewing on glass bulbs. <laughs> they're plastic. They're harmless. They're not gonna hurt her. <laughs> but it was like a way to occupy her so she wouldn't eat the tree while we were decorating it. Do you want to say bye? Say thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to check out my mommy's other channel, the link is in the description. If you want to follow her on social media, there are links also in the description. And we'll see you guys later in a new vlog. Bye guys!